हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू प्रतिभा टेक सो लेट्स कंटिन्यू ऑन आवर सीरीज ऑन जावा सेवेंटीन फीचर्स इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव सीन अबाउट रिस्टोर ऑलवेज स्ट्रिक्ट फ्लोटिंग पॉइंट सीमेंटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल कवर एनहैंसड सूडो रैंडम नंबर जनरेटर्स सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सूडो रैंडम नंबर जनरेटर्स और पी आर एन जी दिस इज ऑल्सो रेफर्ड एज जेप थ्री फिफ्टी सिक्स विच प्रोवाइड्स न्यू इंटरफेसेस एंड इम्प्लीमेंटेशंस फॉर सूडो रैंडम नंबर जनरेटर्स इट ऑल्सो प्रोवाइड बेटर सपोर्ट फॉर स्ट्रीम बेस्ड प्रोग्रामिंग विच विल सी इन द कोड सेक्शन इन द इन द वीडियो फर्दर इट इज ऑल्सो ईजियर टू यूज डिफरेंट अलगोरिदम टू जनरेट डिफरेंट रैंडम नंबर सो वी कैन कंसिडर द दीज आर द फोर गोल्स फॉर एडिंग दिस पर्टिकुलर फीचर इन जावा सेवेंटीन फर्स्ट गोल एज एज वी हैव ऑलरेडी सीन दैट मेक इट ईजियर टू यूज वेरियस पी आर एन जी एलगोरिदम्स इंटरचेंजेबली इन एप्लीकेशन बेटर सपोर्ट स्ट्रीम बेस्ड प्रोग्रामिंग बाय प्रोवाइडिंग स्ट्रीम्स ऑफ पी आर एन जी ऑब्जेक्ट्स थर्ड गोल इज टू एलिमिनेट को डुप्लीकेशन दैट वॉज प्रजेंट इन द एग्जिस्टिंग पी आर एन जी क्लासेस एंड फोर्थ वन इज टू केयरफुली प्रिजर्व एग्जिस्टिंग बिहेवियर ऑफ क्लास java dot util dot random so though it is considered as a enhanced enhanced version of the random number generators so but then also it will try to preserve all the previous properties that was there in that java dot util dot random class so uh, here we can see that um in this with this release four new specialized generators interfaces were added in this new feature first one is a splitable generator that enabled creating a new generator as a descendant of the current one so you can have a separate generator that will provide independent results second one is the jumpable generator allow jumping ahead a moderate number of draws so using this generator you can skip some some draws and you can you can jump to a particular ones that means after some after after certain jumps after some certain skips third one is the leapable generator that allow jumping ahead a large number of draws so if you compare it with jumpable generator then it provides a larger skip and the fourth one is arbitrarily jumpable generator that add more jumps to the leapable generators so for for the generation of random numbers in java 17 so these are the various classes that has been added or we can refer to as different algorithms which we can use to generate random numbers so these are under different categories different groups so we will look at them in detail while going through the code section so let's move to sts so i've just created one class here that is called random number generator this is using jdk and jre of java 17 that is java 17 is being used for this one so here we can see um whenever i am using this random random is equal to new random so this random was existing earlier also so it will still still print whatever it it used to print earlier that means whenever we do next int it will print some value whenever we will do random dot next double it will print some double value so it it is still restoring the existing properties of random classes so and <clears throat> and now when we look at this random generation factory so this code is to add and uh, this code is to see what all what all algorithms that that have been added which we can use while generating the random numbers so if i just try running the code whatever i have till now so here i'll uh, i can see if i just do run as java application okay so he, see this one random dot next double is is generating some double number and next int is generating some integer number and this one um this random generator generator factory that is printing all those different algorithms or the different classes that have been added 
uh, with uh, this new feature in Java 17 so that we can use this classes as an algorithm to use different types of random numbers. So again, the, this, this is the same thing whatever we have seen in the PPT, all these things. So now uh, let's go ahead and try some coding, some hands-on coding with related to Java 17 um, features which is which are based on a stream a stream API that means stream based operations. So for that, first I'll uh, open uh, I'll just uh, create an object for random generator. This is, actually this is an interface. Generator, so initially now we are going with a default one without using any algorithm. So I'm just doing get default. So if I open this one, um, let me first open this random here. Let me first open this random class here. So see, um, this we are into this uh, docs of um, Java 17. So here uh, we are inside this one random, which is implementing random generator. So all those property, what was there in, in random that are still intact. So now if we move to random generator interface here, this one. So, so here we can see, uh, this is the random generator interface. So now we are calling this get default. So by default, it will it will use this class, this class or this algorithm to generate the random numbers. If I move down, then you can see different uh, methods available in this random generator interface, which is, is replicated, then you can print the doubles also. Then you can pin, print the doubles with upper bound and lower bound. So different different functionalities are there. Similar, similarly, we can um, play around with the int type of data sets which we will see in, see in the while coding. Similar that longs are there. And if we go below, then we can see different types of uh, those uh, four interfaces that have been added as splitable generators, and jumpable, all those things. All those things are part of this uh, random generator classes, this interface only. So now let's go ahead this one. As we have seen that this will use one of the interface which has been displayed in here below. So that's fine. Uh, so <clears throat> now let's try to print something calling system dot out dot print ln. So now um, using this generator reference, using this generator reference, we'll try printing ints. Okay, and now um, here, uh, as we have seen the different methods there, where, uh, where we had option to give some lower bounds and upper bounds. So, so just suppose I'm giving lower bound as 100 uh, and upper bound as 200. And uh, since it is integer and it is dealing with that um, wrapper type of thing, so we will just mark it as boxed. So it will con convert it into streams of integer. Now. Um, after that, uh, we are setting here limit. We have the option to set limit that I want 10 numbers, 10 of the random numbers, which is between 100 and 200. And simply, I just want to print it as a, I just want to collect it as a list. So in Java 17, uh, in Java 8, we used to do collect dot collector dot as a list. Here we can directly use to list because it is in Java 17. So we do not have to require uh, writing all those things. So now if I try running this one again, so see, um, as you can see in the last line, see it has printed all the random numbers which are 10 in count and uh, these random numbers are between our lower bound, which was 100 and upper bound between 200. So now let's try doing similar thing with, uh, um, I'll just copy this part so that I can save some time. 
okay so generator dot now we can try with some doubles value doubles um, here I can give 10 and uh, suppose 2000 then again I'm um, converting it to streams then again see if, uh, here if I do not set the limit then it might give some memory issue um, because it might continue generating the random numbers many multiple times so that's why um, this uh, I'm setting some limit here that I need the limit up to something something 20 in numbers 10 in numbers 5 in numbers something like that so here I can give 5 then to list again and just print this so if I do this uh, if I run try running this then you we can see we'll get see we have got five double type of number which is ranging between 10 and uh, 2000 so here if I try removing this one let's see what what happens if I try if I don't give that limit thing there let's see uh, see it, it has given some error it is giving java heap space issue that's why that uh, limit is required so that you can restrict the algorithm to generate only certain lim certain limited number of uh, random numbers instead of going for the unlimited ones so similarly um, just we can try another for let's copy this entire thing now instead of this one let's try some longs value longs we can keep it same here we can give let's give 20 here okay run it again So this output is printing the long type of number that is ending, ranging between 10 and 2000. So uh, these are the things. So now, now we can see one example. Um, as we have seen that these are the different algorithms that has been given or different classes. Uh, using that uh, um, we can create uh, different types of random numbers. So we can just see how we can use this. So what we can do. Uh, we can again. Um, copy this one and we'll try to modify this this one so instead of using the default one now we, uh, we have certain uh, algorithms which we can use to get uh, to generate the reference of uh, random number generators so i'm saying that instead of get default i'm using off now um, i can simply use anything like mix random random taking anything control c um, I'm using this this uh, algorithm for generating random number when I was using default so at that time certain this one L32x64 mixed random that was getting used so now I have used something different one 121 mixed random something like something different one so using different algorithm it will be used so I'm just renaming it to algo so that we do not get that issue of uh, same variable so now we can try printing the same uh, let's try printing integer only and whatever we have printed here and just replace the generator with algo algo so now whatever the random numbers will be generated so um, that will be generated using this algorithms so now again let's try running this java application so here we can see um, whatever we have given the limit as between 100 and 200 using this algorithm some random numbers have been generated so you can um, you can try playing around with all these random numbers and you can see that how these things are getting implemented yeah so that's all in this video so um, if you like the video, please subscribe to the channel, please share it, like it.
थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग